Hi, welcome to Local News TV. I'm here in Bedford for Soccer League UK's National Annual Tournament. There are 32 teams playing today and it's already looking to be a successful day. Basically what the Soccer League UK does is operates as a league where people join and then they play small sided football leagues during the evenings. Now from that we've took the opportunity to organise a bigger event which is a national tournament. So this is why you're here today to witness the national tournament. We've got teams from all over the country. Teams are here from Scotland, from Leeds, down to Brighton, Portsmouth, all the way to Wales. Uh, and so it's, it's become a national project and the idea is in the future we want to expand Soccer League UK into other areas. I'm here with the newly elected MP for Bedford, Richard Fuller. How are you today? I'm well Emily, how are you? I'm good, thank you very much. Good. Are you excited for today's tournament? I am. Well here we are one week ahead of uh, you know, the World Cup and England's first game. I'm not here for any uh, tryouts for England, just here <laughs> to support Soccer League UK which is a great Bedford group and uh, what a great day to have a, a tournament today. You're going to be doing a bit of football yourself in a bit? Apparently we're doing a, a penalty shootout between me and, uh, and the mayor. Um, so uh, all bets are off in terms of uh, coalition <laughs> politics for that. I've been invited, this has um, been going since uh, 2004, uh, it's growing every year. The Football League it's based on, the, the Six Aside is the fastest growing football league with 1,300 youngsters coming here every week to play football. That's got to be a good thing to try and get youngsters involved in football and in sport and, and football brings us all together. And I saw you have a little game. Little <laughs> yeah, can we move over that very quickly? <laughs> uh, I've just lost the MP on a penalty shootout, but uh, true England style, lose on a penalty shootout. So I was, I was hindered by the chain, so I was hindered by the chains. So. <laughs> Uh, yeah, quite heavy, but not, not the best year to play football in, but it was good fun. OK, basically, football freestyle is performing tricks of a football or other items like a tennis ball using every part of the body, trying to be a creative, using other things and so on. Wow, that sounds really good. Um, do you, are you here all the time or do you travel about? I travel about the whole country, uh, been Nottingham, everywhere really, all around the country doing different types of events, uh, you, being used in uh, commercials for Nike and so on like that, so it's excellent. So I wanted to be different, basically. So you're going to stick with this now? Or you I am. Back to football? No, I'm going to stick with this. Definitely and stick with this. Yeah, style. definitely. It's brilliant. <laughs> okay, cool. Well, I hope you have a great time today and we'll look at you doing some freestyle. Thank you. Um, do you think you can give us a little demonstration? Yeah, sure. Let's do it. <laughs> Now, there's a couple of things that we do from that. One, the money that we generate goes back into football and sponsors a lot of uh, small teams who are struggling for finance. So we, we support them. Some of the money goes, for example, we've paid £600 to Haiti, Haiti earthquake. We gave £1,300 to British Red Cross in the past. So we help organisations such as that. It's been a great day here in Bedford. The rain is just starting to fall. It's been a really successful day and some very important people like the Mayor of Bedford and Richard Fuller, the newly elected MP for Bedford. Um, there are lots of different teams here today, 32 in total, and it's like our mini World Cup. So I'm Emily Blake for Local News TV.